हेलो एवरीवन अस्सलाम वालेकुम आदाब सस्यकाल नमस्ते एंड वेलकम टू शरीस पकवान टुडे आई एम मेकिंग स्पाइसी कोरियन कॉलीफ्लावर बाइट्स रेसिपी एंड इट्स सुपर इजी डिलीशियस एंड क्रंची एंड लेट्स सी व्हाट वी नीड To make a chili garlic paste, you need soaked dried red chilies, garlic, a little water to make a fine paste. Please check the description for the whole process. To prepare a mixture of sauce, take about one teaspoon of tomato ketchup, light soy sauce, and vinegar, and stir well and keep aside. To make a slurry for the cauliflower coating, combine two tablespoons of flour. 2 tablespoons of cornstarch or corn flour. Now add all the spices: salt, black pepper, garlic powder, and also baking soda. And gradually add water to make a slurry. In a bowl, take cauliflower bites and add the prepared slurry and coat completely and keep aside. Let's cook. Take a pan, add two tablespoons of oil on medium flame. When oil is hot enough, add cauliflower bites. Cook the cauliflower on each side until it becomes crispy. Now cook on the other side. Cook the remaining cauliflower bites in the same way and add the oil if needed to cook the second batch and keep it aside. To make a sauce, take a pan and heat to a medium flame and add two teaspoons of butter or oil in the pan. After a minute later, add two tablespoons of chili garlic paste and sauté for a minute. Now add. chilled garlic paste water and stirred for 2 to 3 minutes after 2 to 3 minutes later now add the prepared sauce and mix well and cook for about 1 to 2 minutes after a minute later now put the fried cauliflower bites in the sauce and i find sometimes the cauliflower is too soft gently toss it in the sauce for couple of minutes that's it spicy korean cauliflower bites are ready to eat now let's dish out and see i topped with some sesame seeds and little bit of scallions or green onions and they are just amazing and taste so so delicious You can make a nice grill sandwich or you can eat as an appetizer. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe to Sharif Pakwan and also turn on the bell icon for watching more exciting recipes from me. And also please do follow me on Insta for quick updates. Thank you.